With ASU Baseball and Regionals, there's no better time to get to know the Sun Devils. Pitcher Grant Schneider is a man of many impersonations, and a handful of players have ties to professional sports. I'm really good at when I hear something, I immediately remember like how it sounds and then I just repeat it. So I don't know, I started my dad was good at it and then I got that talent from my dad. Hey Isma, got the poison for Cusco. Cusco's poison. Nasty little hobbitsies. They took the precious from us. Hey, Peter. Uh, me and Bonnie are going to the clan, so. Quagmire, I'm gonna have to ask you to hand over your keys. Okay. Well, I just heard the news today. Seems my life is gonna change. Players with pro ties include Andrew Snow whose cousin is MLB player Dustin Pedroia, Tyler Williams, whose father is a scout for the Minnesota Twins, Daniel Williams, whose brother plays football for the Buffalo Bills, and Garvin Alston Jr., whose father is a bullpen coach for the Arizona Diamondbacks. It's, it's like any other relationship with your cousin, you know? You go over to the houses, you just be family, you know? But when it started to come to baseball, I mean, I would always, we'd always go watch him play, and I always remember him just dominating. As far as having a guy like Dustin as your cousin, it's always really nice when you have questions because he, I mean, you're gonna have somebody you rely on. Um, I started at a really young age, and you know, just wanted to be like dad, and you know, started at when I was like six, and since I wanted to be like my dad, I just started playing, and I played basically most of my life. It's different, I guess. I mean, I'm used to it now since this is going to a sixth year, so now I'm kind of used to it. But the first two years, I was just like, can't believe you're actually playing, and. Uh, Every year, my it's either my mom or my dad has literally gone to every single game somewhere. Um, we go up there for Christmas. Uh, my parents don't want him spending Christmas by himself. I got to be the bat boy all the time, uh, sitting in the dugout. Um, actually, my when the Oakland Athletics were here, uh, Coco Chris tweeted out, uh, sitting here with Little G and Big G. So it's always been like a fun thing being in the clubhouse and. Uh, he always just made sure that I knew what I was doing and allowed me to grow, and then now he's developed me into more of a pitcher. During the fall, like when he's back um, in Arizona, and I'm out here just trying to get better, I mean, I'll, I'll go over to his house, eat dinner with his family and stuff. During the summer, he would do his pro coverage, and when I was younger, I was allowed to go with him with um, one of my brothers, and we would travel um, to different states for um, about a month and just watch a lot of baseball and just learn the game, you know, first hand experience. So we're sitting around the house sometimes, we're watching games on TV and he will be like, hey, you see how he's doing that or, or watch the way he throws that pitch and stuff like that. So I can kind of understand and um, it's just good around, just around the house. Fellow athlete and brother, he pretty much tells me not to suck. I'm just kidding. Uh, no, but he just tells me um, there's going to be a lot of bumps going in the road and if you, if you really have a goal and you really like playing the sport, like I just got to just keep pushing. So nothing's gonna be easy.